Am I better at writing with my left hand yet? Bam. Um, mm, you're probably going to have to look at the time lapse for that one because that was just a total mess. Alright, it's looking pretty good if I add this colour again. New book time! Well, it's not actually new book time. I'm just in the middle of my old book, but I left it at mum's, so I have to colour in something. So, new book time! Oh my god, this is going to be so much fun. This is going to be so much fun. What else have we got? <gasps> There's so much pinks and lights. Oh, I remember I was steering, I was steering clear from um, dark colours with this edition. Oh, this is going to be so much fun. Am I better at writing with my left hand yet? No. Enough of that. Well, normally with all my other books, I start with the blacks, but I'm kind of like this. I want to do that over the brown, so I'm just gonna. Oh, pink! It's actually named what it's called. Okay, where well, we got hot pink. Okay, we're on a roll. Scarlet. That's the last one. Crimson. Scarlet's the odd one out. I'm having so much fun already. Look at this giraffe. It's just so fun. <laughs> okay, so the plan is gradient. Mm. Alright, well the colour wheel says red, brown, yellow. Yep, yep, that's that's that works. Alright, I got a metallic, sky blue, that makes sense, and teal. Alright, normal names. You know what, I think I was meant to do this colour in this little corner. Oops. Um, I'm, I'm not entirely sure. I don't think I have this colour, but let's put a mixture in. I'll start with this one. Bam. Um, mm, you're probably going to have to look at the time lapse for that one because that was just a total mess. I used a rubber, I used some green and some blue and some other blue. What is this called? Walnut brown. Oh my god, walnuts are not this colour, but okay. Whatever. Maybe the casing of a walnut is this colour, but like, that, that's kind of part of the tree. So I guess this is like tree brown, bark brown, tree bark brown. I would have accepted hazelnut brown. Definitely not as narrow as I wanted it to be. I think I'm done with this walnut brown for now. Yellow ochre, I believe that is. I'm just going to cover the whole thing in this. I read this backwards for a second there, um, Red Indian, and I was like, wait. Isn't that like a thing? I'm trying to make it look really detailed and I get to like parts like this and I think I need grey. Silver. <laughs> it's grey. Alright, it's looking pretty good if I add this colour again. Alright, I think I'm good with this for now. I've been looking forward to this just because it looks like simple and cool at the same time. Just picked up whichever blue this time. Cool. Yep. Um. Oh, it's watercolor. Oh, cool. Okay, wait a minute for this. Still waiting. I'm not done, but I'm adding midnight green. Okay, I think water's gonna get like these. There you go. These things. I just have absolutely no clue. Ok, 
Okay, winging it. If someone does a better job, definitely please show me. Okay, I'm thinking I'm achieving what's going on over there, but I have mixed feelings now. These blues look the same, but I'm not in the mood to use the same colour, so I'm just going to use this one. Ocean blue, that's it. Oop. Guys, I was thinking about my blues and I was like, what do I even call this? And it's got names, like when the fuck did this happen? So is this a sky blue? That's appropriate. Look at that sky. Three different blues here, including that new one that I like. Well, this isn't a filming and doing kind of activity, but you get the gist. Well, these lasers might actually be executed pretty well. What is this? Teal? I hope it's teal. Sky blue. Oh, I want sky blue. I could make the lasers green. That'd be pretty cool. Teal. I should shop in this. You know what? I think it looks a bit worse than it did a minute ago. I'm gonna throw in some, um, Aquamarine. Okay, I agree with these lasers. These are fine. I want to see, I definitely want to see how other people do the lasers because that was interesting. Pink. Okay, I see that the cloud is pink, but I'm just, I'm not going to just use pink. <laughs> it's a Lord of the Rings meme. Um, I kind of see like a purple here and then the pink and some gray. So I'm going to use some medium gray. That's very appropriate. And lavender? Okay, I'll go with lavender. Pink. Oh, finally, a name that actually is the color. Alright. Just throw this in the dark a bit. And there you go. Showing it from far away gives it justice. Pink. I think I'll just do the whole thing and then erase the other bits. Very well executed. Excellent. Okay, I'm just going to trade these two for some sort of blues. Choose some grey that looks like blue and ultramarine. It's not going to match the picture because I used quite an array of blues here. It's just going to blend. Blue. Oh, I didn't cross hatch it. Alright, later. Maybe. Gosh, that just straight up looks terrible. I switched blue. Much better. I erased it and then added normal blue. But I've got some sort of ugly yellow here, so I'm going to put grey and metallic yellow for that bit. I don't know if metallic is ugly enough. I like it! Even though it's a colouring, like, definitely a fan. Maybe it's the lasers. Oh, you are? Maybe it's the ground. The ground looks intense. Definitely intense. This is going to be a fun book. Yeah, you can see that. Not, not if I do that, but you can see it. Um, if you want to grab this book, there's a link below if you want to color along with the time lapse as well. That's on my time lapse video. Yeah, this is going to be a fun book.